are going to budget out paycheck number two for April for 2020. So we are going to budget $980 for, um, for paycheck number two. And we're going to do mortgage, which is, let me put it down here. Mortgage, which is 250 Truck payment is 208 Food is 150 Electric is 50 Water. Give you guys in just a tiny bit. Okay. Water is 25, cable is 19, we have um, security system, security which is 22, not 20, because it went up, 22 we have for the security system. We have Capital One, Capital One is going to be 50, we have My Life Insurance, which is 10, we have, I'm trying to think of what else there was, because I know there was, there was more than than that that I have right down. Oh, lawn is 10. Gas is 80. I dropped the gas down $10 right now. So we're only going to do $80 in that envelope for for gas. Um, not to see, what am I missing? Um, the first paycheck up, cell phone. Cell phone is 25. Food, water, cable, or cell phone. Capital One. Gas. I like to put our allowance down, which will be probably $80 for the allowance. And I have the life insurance. So we have Hulu which is 14 and we have I'm trying to see what else we had cable cell phone capital one hulu security gas and i think that is it i believe that is it for 980 so we're going to add that up real quick. If I forgot something, which we'll see, because I do sometimes forget. So 250 plus comes out to $993. So that is going to put us over budget, which my husband will probably get more than this, but I always like the, the budget on the 980 So right now we are $13 over the budget. So I have to probably cut um, our allowance will cut that down to like seventy dollars so maybe minus ten and would still be three dollars over so minus ten 
cut. Um, so this way I have, um, now we're down to 983 and the lawn will just do five dollars because I have enough lawn money in there. Well, I should have left that there and then we'll do minus five will give us 978 and this is cut from the lawn so I'm going to put that over here and then we're at 978 which gives us a difference of two dollars difference two dollars but that is it. I'd rather take it from the lawn and take it from the gas. Since the gas is like really low, it's anywhere from a dollar, I'm going to say a dollar seventy one to a dollar eighty five here. So, and he still has, he filled up once on the ninety dollars of the gift card that he took out and he filled up on that. So he still has like. 30 or $60 still left on that, that card from the $90. So he has money left, but he hasn't touched it. He's still been using that gift card that he got the, at Walla for a $90 gift card. So he's still using that money for gas. So I figured, okay, well, I'll cut it down another $10 to $70. And then this way he'll have enough money in there to get him through for the rest of... Uh, the rest of April but that is it for this bu this budget it's pretty basic it's just mostly the bills the one credit card we're trying to pay off at the moment and at the end of the month I do take out for our security system and Hulu which I do that at the end of the month but I'm gonna be switching things up in May so when I do my May budget, which won't be for probably another week or so, maybe two weeks, um, there's things that I'm going to be switching up. But that is it. We have budgeted $980. Um, he didn't get a lot of overtime, so overtime has really slowed up. Um, his work has really slowed up. I believe one day like Thursday last week, um, he was done with his route at 12 o'clock. And then he had to work in the yard there at the, sh at the shop for about two hours, two and a half hours before he, he was, you know, he could leave to come home. Because my husband starts at 5, sometimes 5 in the morning, sometimes 5.30 in the morning. And if he works until 5 in the morning, he's got to stay until 1.30, 5.30, he's got to stay until 2.00. So he started at um, at 5.30 that morning. So he was back at 12. So he worked in the yard for the last uh, two hours that he needed to be at the, um, you know, at the shop. But that's it. Um, there isn't a lot going on. Like I said, it's just basic because anything that's left over I am just throwing it right into savings at the moment until this pandemic is over with and then I can go back of hitting our last credit card that we have really hard because this one those payments right now are like a hundred dollars a month so I want to get this paid off as soon as possible but that's it for this video. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you as part of my YouTube family. And please stay safe. Please stay healthy. And I will catch you guys in the next video. God bless. Bye.